All right, so let us have an example wherein we're going to apply um, the standard form of the equation of the parabola, wherein the vertex is at the origin. So what are we going to do is to write the standard equation of the parabola where the vertex is at the origin and the focus is at 0, comma negative 2, then we have to graph. Okay, so um, to, to, to have our standard equation of the parabola, it would really help us kung igagraph muna natin or ilolocate muna natin sa uh, Cartesian coordinate system yung ating mga given. If this is our Cartesian coordinate system, so that is, the vertex is at the origin, so ito po yung V, and then, ang ating focus, sabi, is at 0, negative 2. So that is, 0 si X, then negative 2 si, uh, si Y. So that is 1, 2. So nandito po yung ating focus. Alright, so kung nasa baba ni vertex ang ating focus, then we have we have um, an idea that the parabola opens downward. So gagamitin po natin yung x squared equals negative 4cy. Okay, now by looking at the, the points of the vertex and the, para, uh, and the focus, how many units, how many units is the distance between them? So, from the origin down to 0, negative 2, then we can have, so ilang units po ang distance nila, and that is 2 units downward. Ibig sabihin, the value of our C would be, sorry, the value of our C would be 2 units. Okay? And if the value of C is 2, then we will be having an idea that our directrix, the directrix would also be 2 units away from the vertex. So, kung si focus ay nasa baba, then ang ating directrix should be nasa taas. And that is 1, 2. So, here where the directrix lie. Alright? And the equation of the directrix would be, since ito ay na kay y-axis, so that would be y equals positive 2. Alright? So, our directrix, so let me rewrite it. Our directrix is at y equals 2. Okay po? So now, we are now ready to uh, we are now ready to have the standard equation of the parabola. Okay? Tulad na sinabi kanina, we'll be using x squared equals negative 4 cy. So that is that is x squared equals negative 4 cy. And then and then, we'll be having x squared so, by, by substitution, by substituting all the necessary value, that would be x squared equals negative 4. Since yung value ni C natin ay 2, so that would be 2. Then, y. And by simplifying this one, we'll be having x squared equals negative 8y. So, this would be our standard equation of the parabola. Okay po? And now, we, uh, we have the idea that our lattice rectum, si negative 8, since we are dealing with uh, the length of the lattice rectum, okay, this is the, the, the length of the lattice rectum. So, if we are dealing with the length, then we are having the absolute value. So, we'll be having the absolute value of 4C and that would be the absolute value of 8. So, that would be 8 units. So, ibig sabihin, uh, mula sa focus, Mula sa focus natin, okay, punta muna ulit tayo dun sa graph. Mula sa focus natin, kung 8 units yung length, and, uh, length ng ating lattice rectum, so yung, uh, yung ating, mula sa focus, di-divide natin yung 8 by 2, so that would be 4. So we have your 1, 2, 3, 4. So nandito, isa dito, at uh, 4 units din sa kaliwa. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4. So ito po yung ating lattice rectum. Okay po, and this, uh, kapag ginarap na po natin siya, pagkoconnectin lang po natin yung dalawang end ng lattice rectum, and that becomes our parabola. Okay po? And, meron po tayong tinatawag na axis of symmetry. Ano naman po yung tinatawag na atin na axis of symmetry? So, si axis of symmetry is actually a line which divides, which divides the parabola into two congruent parts. Okay? 
So, since ang ating vertex ay nasa origin, um, ang ating, kapag ganun po yung case na ang ating vertex ay nasa origin, ang ating axis of symmetry may only be either the x-axis or the y-axis. But since here, we ma makikita naman natin that the y-axis actually divides the, the parabola into two congruent parts, then um, our axis of symmetry would be our axis of symmetry would be the y-axis. Okay po? I'm ah, sorry. That would be the y-axis. Okay? And also, another, another description of the axis of symmetry is that um, it is a line that connects the vertex and the focus. Okay? So that is how we graph the, the parabola with the vertex at the origin and the focus at 0, negative 2. So let us now proceed with our next example. So we are going to write the standard equation of the parabola where the vertex is at the origin and the focus is at 1, 0 and then we have to graph. So same thing goes with what we have uh, with what we did a while ago. First is for us to graph it or locate the point. So the vertex is at the origin and then the focus, sabi dyan, the focus is at 1, 0. So that is Sorry, this is the vertex and then the focus is at 1, 0. So this is where the focus is. Okay, since the focus is on the right of the vertex, then we'll be having an idea that our parabola opens to the right. So ito po yung gagamitin natin. C, Cy squared equals 4Cx. Okay? So, how many units yung layo ni vertex from the focus? That is actually one unit. So, ibig sabihin, the value of C here, or the value of C would be 1. And by, by knowing that the value of C is 1, then we'll be having the idea that the directrix is also one unit away from the vertex. So, kung nasa right si focus, then, si directrix ay nasa left ni vertex. So, we have here one unit. So, nandito po natin matatagpuan yung ating directrix. And, the equation of the directrix. So, yung ating directrix. Yung ating directrix would be at x equals, x equals, sorry. That is, x equals negative 1. So, ito po yung ating directrix. Okay, and by plugging in the form, uh, by plugging in uh, the the value of c to our formula, so that would be y square equals to four times, sorry, so that would be y square equals to four times the value of c here is one, so we have here one x, that would be x. So we'll be having y square is equal to four x. So this would be the standard equation of the parabola. And knowing that 4, uh, 4 C is actually 4 A. Alright? So, kung mapapansin niya si 4 C ay equivalent kay 4. Hence, uh, we have the idea that the latus rectum okay, the latus rectum yung latus rectum natin ay may length na 4 units. So, from the focus, magbibilang tayo ng 2 units above. Alright, so we have here 1, 2. So, isa dito. And then, yung isa naman sa taas. So, we have 1, 2. So, isa dito. So, this would be our latus rectum. Alright, so ayan po yung length ng ating latus rectum. And by connecting the vertex with that of the length or the, the ends of the latus rectum, then we'll be having the graph just like this one. So, we have here this. Okay po? So, that will be the uh, the graph of the parabola wherein the vertex is at the origin and the focus at 1, 0. And our axis of symmetry, our axis of symmetry would be, so, alin po ba ang um, naghahate sa ating uh, parabola into two congruent parts? So, that is, 
So the axis of symmetry would be our, actually, our x-axis. So we have the x-axis as our axis of symmetry. And that's how we, and that's how we get the standard equation of the, uh, the parabola wherein the vertex is at the origin.